An Invasion Day rally is about to begin from Victorian Parliament. Our reporter Holly Edward-Smith is there. Holly, what are protesters planning? Well, Laura, the march is expected to take place in the next 10 minutes or so through Melbourne's CBD, starting from here at Victorian Parliament. They will be protesting on a number of key issues this year. It's not only about changing the date of Australia Day, which for many First Nations people is seen as a day of mourning, but also addressing key issues that they'd like to see make greater large-scale change, including uh, preventing Indigenous deaths in custody, but also this year prioritising treaty over voice. But quickly, as you can see, this is expected to start in the next few minutes and the crowds here outside Victorian Parliament have tripled, quadrupled in the last 10, 15 minutes or so. Speaking with people here, thousands already gathering, blocking off the streets with signs and through their march through Melbourne's CBD, we are expecting a number of speeches to take place, including from Greens Senator Lydia Thorpe. She'll be speaking along the track, which will be ending up at Flinders Station. I also spoke with the rally organiser today, Lydia Thorpe's sister, Marie Onis. She says the point of these rallies is for discussion, not a yes or no blanket answer. But today they really are pushing for treaty to be prioritised over the Indigenous voice to Parliament, which the referendum for that is expected to take place later this year. Holly, thank you.